Hey guys, Mama Vindy here. Welcome back to my channel. Today's grocery haul is going to include everything that we picked up from Sam's Club and also Walmart. We went ahead and grabbed some milk items and such that I usually grab that's close by the house. As you guys know, if you're not already familiar with my channel, I do large grocery hauls because we're a large family of 10. And I also do other various haul videos of like house stuff and holiday hauls, you know, for kids and stuff like that. So if you guys are interested and you're not subscribed already, please go ahead and hit the like button. Subscribe subscribe. It would help my channel so much. I would love to have you guys. So I'm going to go ahead and jump right in here and show you guys everything we grabbed today. It's not quite as big of a haul as we usually do, but I just thought I'd go ahead and do a video since it's been a little bit. I decided to take a few months off for all of you that are already set just to spend time with family and just have some time off. So I thought I'd go ahead and start with today's video for you guys. So I hope you enjoy. This one is Guatemala coffee that we get from Sam's. My husband seems to like this one, the Papa's Pride coffee here. And then we got some Nutella for the kids. A little two pack here. These are 26 and a half ounces here. So we got two pack of those. I went ahead and got some of these mini Sprites for the kids any drink day. My kids usually get one day a week that they get a splurge drink. So I grabbed some of the little mini cans because I figure these are way better size for the little ones to have a soda pop if they choose. Of course, I grabbed my Coke Zero. These are 35 packs also from Sam's. I'll try to insert a couple prices for you guys so you know what the prices have changed to here lately. I um, might not do it for all of them, but I will insert some of the prices for you guys so you can kind of see because there is definitely a change in some of the prices here. Now, I did get the milk, the eggs, and the ice cream from Walmart, so I'll definitely show you guys what the prices were on those. My husband grabbed some of this Tyson chicken nuggets the white meat chicken nuggets for the kids. I believe it's a five pound bag. And also some pizza rolls. There's 160 rolls in there for the kiddos. It was just pepperoni. We also grabbed some meat. Here's some ground beef, which you all know there's definitely a change in prices for these. This is the all natural ground beef, 80% lean, 20% fat. Like right here, this one is $13.09 and this is for 3.29 pounds. $13.05 for 3.28 pounds. $13.13 for 3.3 pounds and then 13.05 you see that 13.05 for 3.28 pounds and these were at Sam's so we got some of those so that's for a couple weeks we also grabbed some of the six pound bags of the chicken breast tenderloins we got one two three bags of those and again I'll show some of the prices there for you guys and then we got two boxes of eggs from Sam's I definitely noticed a difference in the price on the eggs and then the milk as you guys know we're a large family so we typically go through about a gallon a day in milk for our family, yes, we are some milk drinkers over here. So we had some crazy weather today. Also, it was like in the 40s all of a sudden and we're in Florida, so it's kind of crazy. It was just like hot and then all of a sudden it's like pretty cold again. <laughs> so we got our 12 gallons of milk that I typically get every two weeks, as you guys know. And then as a bit of a splurge, which I wasn't planning on getting. And then as I was heading on over to Walmart, my husband asked me to get him some peach ice cream. So I got him the peach peachy peach. I got some strawberries and homemade vanilla because I have a couple of little ones that like strawberry. I got some chocolate chip. I got two of those for a while there <laughs> during the uh, pandemic, you guys. I could not find chocolate chip anywhere for some reason. I don't know what was going on with that. If any of you guys know about what happened with that, I would love to hear, but they actually had some chocolate chips, so I got two of those because that's always a favorite. We also got some homemade vanilla. We got some cookies and cream. Who doesn't love the cookies and cream, right? So six all together for the Bluebell ice cream and we just love that ice cream. So that's the one that I grabbed. And I also got some of the little miniature mini cups for the kids. They love just grabbing a quick little cup as a treat sometimes for their dessert. So this one has the Dutch chocolate and the homemade vanilla. Six of each in that. So I grabbed two of those. And then moving on to the fruits and vegetables. I got a bag of onions. I got a big old watermelon. We got a five pound bag of apples, the Fuji apples. And then also the Granny Smith apples. Another five pound bag of that. Those looked pretty good. I was gonna get the Honey Crisp apples, but those were like over $10 a bag. So these were only like six something. So I just went ahead and grabbed these. I got two things of blueberries here. 
because we love having the blueberries, bananas, and strawberries on breakfast pancakes. So I got two little bundles of the organic bananas. We also got two packages of strawberries. So those looked pretty good and they smelled delish. And then I also got a bag of oranges. I got two big bags of the, the russet large potatoes. Here lately, I've just been going close to the house. Walmart, getting the small little bags that they have at Walmart. I can't stand cooking with those, you guys. It takes forever to peel the potatoes and stuff. So I was so happy to finally get out there to Sam's today, grab a couple bags of the potatoes, which these went up quite a bit in price too. I think these were like over $8 a bag for these potatoes, which is crazy. I also also got some of the sweet bell peppers. I got two bags of those and also two bags of the green peppers over there. They come with six in each of those. And we also got two bags of the avocados. Those obviously went up in price as well. Crazy, but you guys know I have to have my avocados. We use those in so many different things. We love guacamole. We love using them on quesadillas, our breakfast sandwiches, you know, egg sandwiches and just so many different things. It's so yummy. And then I got a bag of lemons. I had gotten a bag of limes, but I noticed the price on the limes were like over $7 for a little bag. The lemons were only three something. I just decided to put the limes back. We got some tomatoes for our BLTs, which yeah, we used the avocados on the BLTs. Here's some of our favorite easy sandwiches, BLTs. Just toast up some sourdough bread. You've got bacon, lettuce, tomatoes, some avocado slices, and mayo. Super simple and delish. So we got some lettuce and tomato over here. Two of these Romaine Hearts bundles here for our BLTs and salads and so forth. And then I got two packages of the crescent rolls. These are the same. These are like four, four ninety eight. I don't think I know the price difference on those. And then I also got two of the packages they didn't have the one I usually get, but they did have the Nutri's own white wheat bread packages, two packs here. So I went ahead and got two of those as well. And I also recently ordered a big pack of the kimchi to stock up on because we ran out of that. So I'll just go ahead and insert that as well. My Sam's online order was $191.76. That was for 12 kimchi noodle cases. Each had 18 in it. It was $15.98 each, and that was about $0.89 cents per bowl. And this is what it looks like when I put it on top of the pantry. And that was pretty much everything for this haul, you guys. I hope you enjoyed it. And I will see you guys next time. Thank you so much for watching. Bye. Okay, guys. So I decided to add a second part to this video because I had to go back to Sam's. I hadn't posted my video yet. So I just figured, well, I'll just add it all into the video since you guys like seeing big grocery hauls and everything. And this is just how it usually works out. I go and I get things that I think I need and then I need more stuff. And so I end up going back. We also went to the commissary. I grabbed some things. I have a birthday coming up this weekend. So I'm just going to kind of include all that together. I may also include a quick clip of something that I got for my daughter's birthday because I'm so excited to give it to her. So I might show you guys what that is. So just hang tight. I'm going to go ahead and show you guys everything we grabbed from Sam's. A couple items. I got this package of Glad trash bags because we're completely out. This is 120. This isn't the usual one that I get. As you guys know, I like the, the lavender scent we get from BJ's. But there's this Glad Force Flex Plus with the Clorox that eliminates food, bacteria, and odors. Hopefully that works out good. And then also we're going to be grilling. Speaking of grilling, I thought I'd share these delicious Wahoo steaks that our neighbor shared with us. He caught these. My husband grilled it up and his 11-year-old son and him went deer hunting and they made these delicious sausages with him and they were so, so good, you guys. Water that's turning five had requested hot dogs, chips, and watermelon <laughs> on her birthday. So we're going to go ahead and grill up and we got this two-pack of the Kingsford Match Light Charcoal. I went ahead and got my husband some of this Kingsford Charcoal Lighter Fluid. We're 100% out of our lighters. So I went ahead and grabbed a pack of these. Thankfully, you guys know they keep all that stuff together there. So uh, this one has a flex in it and then also three of the regular ones so that's a pretty good deal there and we got the crescent rolls these are what 4.98 i just bought these with the other haul <laughs> in the first part of the video but of course those are already all gone so literally a couple days there and those things were gone so i got two packs of those and i got some reynolds wrap this two pack of the larger foil that we usually use grilling i went ahead and got that i also got some of the smaller foil pans because we're going to be barbecuing also i got 
got some paper plates because we're gonna have a lot of things going on this summer and all that kind of stuff. I got a pack of the forks. We got the gold regular all-purpose flour, big pack there, 12 pound bag. And then I have a daughter that's wanting to make some beignets. So she got a couple of ingredients. I think we got that from the commissary. The bread flour and we also got some biscuit from Sam's. A couple of the spices. I just got some salt, some black pepper, paprika, carnation milk. I don't know what she's gonna be making, but she has some things that she wants to make. We also have some supreme triple chunk brownie mix. She wants to make some of those. She's been doing a fasting for the last few days and she just like, you guys know you should never go into the grocery store when you're hungry because you need to start picking all this junk food. But <laughs> nonetheless, she's gonna make some brownies maybe on her sister's birthday, maybe before, I don't know, we'll find out. And then she also grabbed some of the dry yeast for one of her recipes she's wanting to make. I went ahead and grabbed some more of the little fruit cups for the little kiddos. Their favorites are the diced pears and the diced peaches. So I got four each of those. I also grabbed some of the vegetable oil and my daughter grabbed the peanut oil for whatever she's making there. I finally also grabbed some hot dogs. I don't know if there's a difference. I was trying to compare it in the store, but these are what, 24 packs, six resealable packages of the 100% Angus beef. And it says jumbo <laughs> uncured Angus beef rings. I'm not sure. They look, I don't know, what do you guys think? They look like the regular size to me. Maybe they're a little slight bigger. I don't know. But I got four packs of those from the commissary. I also went ahead and grabbed the bacon from the commissary. I got 12 packs of these because, I don't know, it just seems so much cheaper. It's like three something per pack. So I got 12 of these. I got three bags of shrimp from the commissary. These were $11.99 each because I want to make some etouffee, also some shrimp scampi coming up. I got two bags of the Tostita. All the chips were from Sam's, so you guys know the prices on this. is Tostita's bite size. The regular ones, these are out there for birthday parties and so forth. We got the Cheeto Puffs back here, the regular Crunchy Cheetos, some Ruffles, some regular Lay's, some Funyuns, and some Doritos. I also picked up some more butter. We're almost out of butter, so I just, geez, these were like, these went up in price. These were $4.04 at the commissary. I'm not sure how much they are at Walmart or Publix or whatever. I'm gonna kind of check that out here in a little bit when I go over there to get some helium for her balloons that I'm gonna be airing up, but these definitely went up. So I literally only got 12 of these this trip, so I can put them in the freezer. We still have like maybe four packs in the refrigerator, which literally last time I went, I got cheese, a bunch of cheese and butter. I think I got 20, 24 packs of butter and we are already out. That tells you guys how much we cook. We cook with butter and we make all kinds of recipes and stuff like that we bake and so forth. And so yeah, I went ahead and got 12 of these. I went ahead at Sam's, got another three pack of the Ready Whip and then a couple of the vegetables I needed for the ATFA that I didn't grab because they didn't look good at Sam's. I went and got two packs of the celery and a pack of two packs of the little or bundles of the green onions and then also for this weekend we're going to be doing burgers and hot dogs so i got two packs of the 16 count hamburger buns and 16 count hot dog buns there for my little baby and then also i got a pack of the tortillas these were cheaper than the low carb ones so i just went ahead and grabbed these these were like four something for two 18 counts so i went ahead and grabbed that that was pretty much everything that i'm going to add to this haul i hope you guys liked it hope everybody's doing awesome and i'm going to show you guys what i have my little one it's going to be so cute Look at how adorable this is, you guys. Oh my gosh. She is gonna flip out. We're having her party today. <laughs> just thought it'd be fun to show you guys. I mean, I'm so excited to give this to her. We just recently watched the Lucas movie. Is it Lucas? Luca. Luca movie. <laughs> and they had, you know, this in that movie. And I'm just so excited. I wanna turn it on so you guys can see. <laughs> Headlights and the other lights work so cute. And it plays the music. Anyhow, so cute. I'm about to give it to her for her birthday right now. So adorable. Oh, and there's like a storage compartment back here. Part of it, her stuff. There's the little pebble down there, it has little trainers. So cute, you guys. <laughs> so excited. You guys have an awesome weekend coming up, and I'll see you guys in my next video. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit the notification bell so you can see all my latest videos. If you love grocery hauls and, you know, holiday hauls and just home decor hauls and stuff like that, those are the kind of videos I do, and I would love for you guys to support my channel and subscribe. Thank you so much for watching. I'll see you guys next time. Bye.